boy Max, one for one trade. 60 deal right here, some Van Dyke. Thank you. We made it to the Farnborough Card Show here in England. I'm super excited to be here for the show. We are looking for tons of singles, $10, $20, $100. We'll find all this different cool inventory in there. So much soccer, a lot of F1 as well. Uh, just very pumped to be here. Lots of great vendors. Hopefully we can hear some cool stories and uh, do a lot of deals, like I said. So be on the lookout. All of the singles from these episodes, most of them are going to be available on Whatnot on our channel, Slab Socks. Look it up. Give us a follow. Save the shows, and you'll be able to find all of our big single shows. Uh, some starting at a dollar. Some will be up there for buy now best offer. I uh, would love to have you all come, make some offers, hang out, have a good time, and let's go find out what's inside and see what we can buy for the shows and to hook you all up with some sweet cards. Here's our SGC Submission Center gym right there. First pickup of the show. We got 100 pounds here from Maximilian Cards. Thank you so much. Yeah, no worries, man. No Alfonso Davies out of 10. All right, Ben and I here, BHA Cards just uh, ripped off the Holland trade. He got the Refractor Auto on card. I got this lot of seven. Ben, how you feeling? Good, good. <laughs> just got the lot here for 550. Thank you, Ben. I appreciate it. It's got G Arena 2020 Merlin Auto PSA 10. Would you mind telling me about this card a little bit more? Tell me that story about the how they released them. I got to put them in the um, in the boxes, so they sent them out to random orders afterwards. That's crazy. That's so cool. Not released in the packs, but tops hook people up. <laughs> Sadio Mane Blue Laser 20. Guy Gus. Gus picking up the absolutely beautiful cane here. England logo patch on card. All right, I'm here with Graham from the UK. Look at that, he's got a Milwaukee sweatshirt on. I had to say, Graham, what, what is with the Milwaukee stuff, man? Uh, so I, I started, uh, my parents and, and I lived in Canada um, in the mid 60s. Uh, and when NFL came to the UK, about mid 80s I really enjoyed watching it on the TV spoke to my father he said oh that there was only one team on television back in the 60s and that was the Green Bay Packers I'm also although not as tall as Aaron I'm, I'm quite tall I'm six foot three and my name is Graham so my nickname has always been Big G the helmet logo so I adopted them and kind of things dominoed from there I've been to Camp Randall to see the Badgers uh, I've been to Milwaukee uh, to see the Brewers play a couple of times. I've been to Lambeau Field yeah. twice. Uh, and I even got to see him play in London recently. But. All right, so you got a lot of cards of these guys? A lot of yeah, Packers yeah, cards? I've got over 10,000 Packer cards going back to 1951. I've got over 4,300 uh, Brewer cards. Oh my gosh. Um, and I also have a, a niche PC that. Um, I collect Wisconsin Badger uniformed players. Yes. Um, so Speaking of the Badgers, you got any connections to some Badger players? Uh, so, yeah, I, um, I've just started my own uh, Instagram page, uh, Wisconsin underscore cards underscore UK. That's legendary. And I put on a uh, upper deck exquisite booklet patch auto of Jared Everderis, numbered out of five. I put it up yesterday. And like a small small child, the next day I was doing backflips <laughs> because Jared Aberderis himself <laughs> liked the card. That's it amazing. Was very nearly the end of my life. <laughs> day two is here. One of our first pickups of the day is this Julian Alvarez. This is Red Eye 10 Prodigy from the new Deco set. Very happy with it. Gonna grade it and probably sell it here pretty soon um, with Deco being a really set, but very nice. Um, update is I'm very tired. <laughs> Um, it's been a lot of traveling. It's been a lot of not much sleep. Now PWCC stream tonight at uh, 2 a.m. Gonna wake up and then I gotta stay up and train right to Gatwick Airport to get to uh, Montpellier, France for the PSG match on Wednesday. Very excited about that, but can't wait for Monday night to actually get a decent night's sleep. Uh, not as busy here today as it was yesterday. However, reason being is that this is different. They sold it in uh, two different days. So you could either set up Saturday, Sunday, or set up both days. Um, I've never seen that before in America. I mean, I know that obviously you could just like not come the next day, but they actually had two options for sales and aim for tickets too. So had to, uh, I guess, understand that. And now it's a little bit smaller today, but still doing some deals. So hopefully get some more good stuff. 
I'm here with my boy Max. One for one trade. I got a Mount Eminence auto. He got the Felix Green yeah. of 99. Close deal, man. High potential, but safe on card auto. <laughs> Pack Wars round one here with Tosin. Okay. You don't do the inserts, do you? Oh, there's no numbers on the back these. I forgot. <laughs> it's a new deco set. So how are we doing this? Um, shoot, that's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> Best player decided by you. <laughs> Ronaldo? No. Okay, that sounds right. down. You win already? <laughs> no, it's a, I'm just messing. I don't know. I, I was expecting numbers. Oh, it's debatable one then, isn't it? Oh, he's got Messi. What do you? Who do you say? Ronaldo or Messi? No, like in, in general. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Here's what I want to say. <laughs> Picked up two more cards, Kamavinga Red, a five, Rookie, and the Sokka, 250 SGC 10. Got the PWCC team here. What's up? Just got these two slabs, Luis Diaz, Contra, Mukoko, here at the Sports Card Direct booth. Thank you, Sam. Appreciate it. Just picked up the True Star Bar Silver at 32 and the Martinelli for 40. Thank you so much, man. No worries, appreciate it. 60 deal right here, some Van Dyke Mane 2015 De Bruyne. We got Azubuki Auto for Nate. 380 on the lot here. How were the pickups? Very good. Good show to buy. <laughs> Not as much as yesterday, but a very good second day on the show. Uh, a lot of vendors, a uh, lot of stuff to pick up, so definitely recommend uh, next time. How many cards do you think you bought? Uh, like number? Number, like of, number? number of, number of cards. Uh, definitely more than 3,000 cards. Woo, 3,000? Mm, yeah, probably. Oh my right, gosh. Easily, easily. Just the boxes yesterday were probably like 2K cards plus today. No, they're like, yeah, definitely. Favorite part of the show? I think uh, make, meeting new people and yeah. actually, re you know, uh, connecting with uh, different collectors and stuff yeah. and like making the deal is also a good part of the show. <laughs> I saw you dealing, <laughs> you love dealing. Yeah, dealing is uh, one of the best things at the show as well, but like, you know, meeting your new people and then like finding that people like the same things as you or they don't like the same things as you, so they sell it. <laughs> so <laughs> and they get a deal. Part. Yeah, All about the deals. Deal. Yeah, amazing deal. Amazing good deal. Awesome. Well, hey. Great talking to you. Also had a great show here um, at the Card Con. Make sure to watch out for more videos on the show in the future. Please subscribe and like the video, and we'll see you all in the next video here at Card Con in 2024.